you doing? Sit up. Uh, well, I figured this. Why? Because I do 100 sit ups every morning. Oh, man. Since when? Well, I didn't think it was the most romantic thing to do when I used to stay the night over. So, uh, what happened to romance? Well, we are going to be waking up every morning together from now on, so I figured I should get back into my regular routine. <sighs> Look, if it's bothering you, I, I can do it in the other room. Uh, no, no, no. It doesn't bother me at all. Okay. <clears throat> 98, 99, 100. <laughs> yes! kind of getting used to your kitchen, so the bacon's kind of well done. See, this is so perfect. Mm. Because if I wasn't living here, I'd be on my way back to the quarter mains by now. This way, we can sit together, and we can talk about any problems that we might be having with each other first thing every morning, and then that way, nothing gets blown out of proportion. Well, <clears throat> talking isn't my strong suit first thing in the morning. Okay, well then I'll be very quiet while you eat. You used up a lot of energy this morning already. Brenda, Here, oh, 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 Brenda, nobody's fed me since I was six months old. If then. And I don't want you to get all bent out of shape, but the, in, in my book, <sighs> bed it isn't for food. by Ellen B and pick up my messages and return some calls. Oh. <laughs> you know that Lois had Ned make his first PR appearance in Schenectady this morning at 6 a.m. I wonder if they're still speaking to each other. Well, with what she cooked up for him, he may not even survive to the conscious tank. <whistles> oh, let's hope that's not Ned now saying that he split. Or saying that he split. Well, we would breach contact from over the concert. Mm -hmm. Brenda Bear, your love life definitely agrees with you. Good morning. Uh, what are you doing here? Yeah, what are you doing here? Well, it's good to see you too, Brenda. Why the chilly reception? I thought we were friends. Well, not since I found out that you pretended to be Lucy's friend so that you could take deception from her and give it to Catherine. And Catherine should watch out. I'm sure you'll turn on her too. Call me when you get to Ellenby, sweetheart. All right. See you later. You're not going to remain a silent partner for long if you keep showing up here like this. I made sure no one saw me. Nobody but Brenda. Oh, but you can handle Brenda, can't you? This couldn't wait. Now, these are the accounts of the Grand K Islands from which the funds will flow. You'll have complete access. I right, use my own name because down there they prohibit disclosure. Exactly. That's why they do such good business. Any questions? A lot of money. It's just a drop in the bucket. I'm impressed. Should be enough for what I need. Yeah, well, I figured as much. Now, my contacts in the islands, how much do they know? As little as possible. But as a matter of fact, at the moment, I'm the only one who knows the complete size. Very cagey. Hey, it's not that I don't trust you. Well, you don't trust me. Yet. Now, if things go well, we can discuss increasing your participation. 
gradually. How do you want to handle the accounting? I have four people on that full-time who uh, report directly to me. 